Hi there, this is Alan, aka Your Old Junkie. I just started this channel about a week or so ago. Thought I would do an introductory video to introduce myself as well as show you around my Ural. This is the little beauty. It's a 2018 gear up in slate gray. Let me show you some of the things that I've done to it. We'll start kind of at the front and go around. You can see I've added some lights up by the headlight as well as some uh, lights that are the same as the sidecar, except that I put some yellow film on them, make them into fog lights. Here's what they look like. Um, I did change out all the bulbs to LEDs with the exception of the tail lights. Have the Ural Touring windscreen. Down here I have the shin guards, two and a one high pipe, a hella horn. Up in the cockpit I have the, the switches for the lights fog lights and uh, driving lights. Heated grips, these are Oxfords. I mounted the little controller right here. Hand guards, mount for my, my Garmin 396 GPS system. Has a toolbox, tractor seat, a luggage rack on the back. Over here I have the shovel mounted and I also have poles for a, uh, a tarp. And down here we have a little medical box with a first aid kit inside. I have bumper and because we have such long distances between gas stations out here I added another fuel can. And then on this side, I have another luggage rack. And that is pretty much it. So I really like the bike. I haven't had any problems with it. I have almost 9,000 miles on it. The only real problems that I would point out for other owners for you guys is that one time while I was going down to San Diego, this little bolt right here came loose and I lost my clutch. So I put some Loctite on it, screwed it back in, and I've never had any problems since. Also one time I was up in the canyon riding and I started leaking fuel all over. I said, oh, what the heck? And this fuel injector um, fuel pipe um, had come basically really loose and I was squirting fuel everywhere. So I kind of used some wire and some zip ties to hold it in place till I got home. And then after I got home, I found out that these little screws right here, they had come loose. So I reassembled it, loctited, loctited the screw back in and it's been tight ever since. The other side I checked and it was loose as well. So I Loctited it in place and again, I haven't had any problems at all. Um, by the way, I do have a can and air filter in there. And on this side, I have my uh, um, electronic jet kit controller right there. And I do also have a battery tender plug which I use for my air compressor, my heated gear, as well as uh, as well as a battery tender. And that's about it for the Ural. Um, again, absolutely love it. It's been a, been a splendid bike. Um, definitely one of my favorites. Oh, and just one final note. Um, we haven't turned the taps on yet out here because it is still very early spring and it still gets to be freezing at night. 
So the Urals are really dirty and I do apologize for that. It will be cleaned up as soon as I can. <laughs>